Stop now. 10 things that reduce testosterone levels by 53% that 91% of men do every day. Testosterone is a crucial hormone for men, often referred to as the fuel that powers the male reproductive system. It plays a vital role in defining male characteristics, influencing fertility, and driving sexual desire. However, as men age, particularly after the age of 40, the natural process of aging leads to a gradual decline in testosterone production, a phenomenon known as testosterone deficiency. This decrease can have significant health implications, with testosterone levels falling below normal, 10 to 35 nanomoles per liter, being a primary cause of male menopause, commonly observed in men over 40. Starting from around age 30, testosterone levels drop approximately 0.8 to 1.3% annually. By the time men reach 40, they may experience a reduction of about 30% in testosterone, leading to noticeable symptoms of andropause, such as headaches, sleep disturbances, irritability, fatigue, and changes in body composition, including increased fat and decreased muscle mass. Among the most concerning effects are those related to sexual health. Many men report a reduced libido, erectile dysfunction, and a significant decline in both sperm quality and quantity, which can severely impact their reproductive capabilities. Understanding the factors that contribute to this decline is essential for maintaining not just testosterone levels but overall health and well-being as men age. In this video, we will explore 10 everyday habits that could be silently lowering your testosterone levels by as much as 53% habits that 91% of men unknowingly engage in. By identifying these habits, we aim to help you take proactive steps to safeguard your health and vitality. Let's dive in. 1. Poor Dietary Choices We've all heard you are what you eat. But did you know that many common American diet staples are quietly sabotaging your testosterone levels? The convenience of fast food and processed snacks has a hidden cost. High consumption of these foods, filled with trans fats, refined sugars, and processed carbohydrates, has been linked to significant drops in testosterone. For instance, obese men have been shown to have up to 50% lower testosterone levels than those of healthy weight much of it related to their dietary choices. Less known is how certain health foods can also harm testosterone. Foods like soy-based products, which are often promoted as alternatives in plant-based diets, contain phytoestrogens, compounds that mimic estrogen. Research shows that consuming large amounts of soy can lead to a 13% reduction in testosterone. So while tofu might seem like a healthy option, over-reliance on it could be working against you. Focus on foods that boost testosterone, like grass-fed beef, wild-caught salmon, and walnuts. These options are not only heart-healthy but also help sustain hormone production naturally. For a real energy boost, add zinc-rich foods like oysters or pumpkin seeds to your diet. Zinc is a mineral crucial for testosterone synthesis. 2. Sedentary Lifestyle Modern American life often revolves around the couch, whether it's binge-watching Netflix or spending long hours at a desk job. This sedentary lifestyle is directly impacting your testosterone levels. 75% of American men lead inactive lifestyles, and it's been proven that men who engage in little to no physical activity experience testosterone levels that are 40% lower than their active counterparts. What's lesser known is that not all exercises are created equal when it comes to boosting testosterone. Strength training, especially compound movements like squats and deadlifts, can increase testosterone levels by up to 30%, while long-distance endurance exercises like marathons can actually reduce testosterone over time, according to recent studies. Focus on short, intense weightlifting sessions or high-intensity interval training, HIT, to naturally raise testosterone levels. Just 20 to 30 minutes of focused, intense workouts three times a week can make a significant difference. You don't need a gym membership, simple exercises using body weight, like push-ups and lunges, can work wonders if done consistently. 3. Chronic Stress In the United States, stress is practically woven into the fabric of daily life. Between demanding jobs, financial pressures, and the rush to do it all, stress has become the norm. But chronic stress is one of the most powerful testosterone killers. 
When you're under stress, your body pumps out cortisol, a hormone that has an inverse relationship with testosterone. Studies from the American Psychological Association have shown that men who experience prolonged stress can suffer up to a 50% reduction in testosterone. A lesser known factor is that small, everyday stressors, such as heavy traffic during your commute or constant notifications from your smartphone, can also contribute to higher cortisol levels over time. While you might not notice the impact immediately, these micro stressors are continuously chipping away at your testosterone. Incorporating mindfulness or meditation for just 10 minutes a day can dramatically lower cortisol levels. Try setting aside time to disconnect from technology and unwind. You'd be surprised at how powerful these small habits can be. Another hidden gem, cold showers. They don't just wake you up, cold exposure has been shown to reduce cortisol and boost testosterone levels. 4. Lack of sleep. Sleep deprivation is an epidemic in America, with one in three adults not getting the recommended seven to nine hours of sleep per night. What most people don't realize is that skimping on sleep has a direct effect on testosterone levels. Studies show that sleeping less than six hours a night can lead to a 15% drop in testosterone, especially if sleep deprivation becomes chronic. What's less known is how even small disruptions to your sleep cycle can affect testosterone. Men who wake up frequently throughout the night or who don't reach the deeper stages of sleep are producing significantly less testosterone. This is why quality matters as much as quantity, create a sleep sanctuary. Keep your bedroom cool, dark, and free of electronic devices. Make sure to stick to a sleep schedule even on weekends. This consistency is key to allowing your body to produce testosterone efficiently. Additionally, Consider magnesium supplements before bed. Magnesium helps relax the body and has been linked to improved sleep and higher testosterone production. 5. Excessive alcohol consumption. In American culture, alcohol is often tied to socializing, whether it's happy hours, football games, or weekend barbecues. But excessive drinking has serious consequences for your testosterone levels. Studies have found that frequent alcohol consumption can lead to a 23% reduction in testosterone, especially when binge drinking is involved. What you might not know is that even moderate, consistent drinking can have a cumulative effect. Alcohol impairs liver function, which is crucial for hormone regulation. And here's a little-known fact, beer specifically contains phytoestrogens due to its hops content, which can lead to increased estrogen and decreased testosterone in men. If you're not ready to give up alcohol completely, consider switching to spirits like whiskey or vodka over beer, and limit your intake to special occasions. This will give your liver time to recover and keep your testosterone production stable. Drinking in moderation can still be part of a balanced lifestyle if you're mindful. Sex, smoking. We all know smoking is bad for our health but few realize the extent to which it affects testosterone. The nicotine and toxins in cigarettes directly harm testosterone production by damaging the Leydig cells in the testes, which are responsible for producing testosterone. Smoking also increases the body's levels of oxidative stress, further disrupting hormone balance. Here's something even fewer people know, vaping is not a safer alternative. While it's often marketed as healthier, Studies show that vaping can cause similar declines in testosterone levels due to the chemicals present in e-cigarette liquids. If quitting smoking feels daunting, start with small steps like cutting back gradually or switching to nicotine patches as a stepping stone. Your body will begin to repair itself faster than you think. And, interestingly, engaging in deep breathing exercises not only reduces cravings but can also lower cortisol levels, giving your testosterone levels the room they need to recover. 7. Exposure to environmental toxins. In modern American life, we are surrounded by toxins, from the plastics in food packaging to the pesticides on our produce. What many don't realize is how these environmental toxins are impacting their testosterone levels. Chemicals like bisphenol A, BPA, and phthalates, commonly found in plastic containers, water bottles, and even receipts, mimic estrogen in the body, 
disrupting the endocrine system and leading to a 53% reduction in testosterone in men exposed to high levels. Studies from Harvard University revealed that men with the highest BPA exposure had 20% lower sperm concentration compared to those with low BPA exposure. Even household cleaners and cosmetics often contain endocrine-disrupting chemicals, EDCs, that accumulate in the body over time. 93% of Americans have detectable levels of BPA in their urine, according to studies by the CDC, showing how pervasive these toxins are. Yet, avoiding them can seem overwhelming, as they are everywhere in our daily lives. One lesser-known solution is to switch to glass containers for food storage and to filter your tap water using an activated carbon filter, which can reduce BPA exposure by up to 99%. For personal care, opt for organic, chemical-free grooming products. Activated charcoal supplements are also a powerful tool to help your body detoxify from accumulated toxins aiding in restoring hormone balance over time. 8. Poor Mental Health In the U.S., mental health awareness has increased, but the connection between mental health and testosterone is less discussed. Anxiety, depression, and chronic mental health issues can wreak havoc on testosterone levels. 20% of American adults experience some form of mental illness each year, according to the National Institute of Mental Health, NIM and studies show that men with depressive symptoms have testosterone levels that are, on average, 20% lower than those without. Interestingly, the relationship works both ways, low testosterone can worsen mental health, creating a vicious cycle. And here's something most people don't know, prolonged use of antidepressants can also lead to testosterone suppression. A study published in the Journal of Clinical Endocrinology found that men taking SSRIs, a common type of antidepressant, experienced an average drop in testosterone of 15 to 25 percent over the course of six months. The impact of mental health medications on hormone balance is often overlooked, but it's something to keep in mind, especially if you're already experiencing testosterone-related symptoms. In addition to seeking professional help, Regular exercise, especially strength training, has been proven to boost both testosterone and mood by releasing endorphins and promoting a sense of accomplishment. Another under-the-radar method is intermittent fasting, which has been shown to improve mental clarity while boosting testosterone production by up to 180% after short-term fasts. Practicing gratitude journaling is also a simple way to reduce stress and anxiety which can help improve mental health and testosterone simultaneously. 9. Overuse of technology In a world dominated by screens, the constant exposure to technology is taking a toll not just on our mental health but on our hormone balance too. Spending excessive time in front of a computer or smartphone leads to a more sedentary lifestyle, sleep disruptions, and even increased stress, all of which can significantly lower testosterone. Blue light from screens, especially when used before bed, suppresses melatonin production by up to 23%, which interferes with your sleep cycle and causes your testosterone to drop. Studies published in the Journal of the American Medical Association, JAMA, have shown that using screens for more than 5 hours per day can lead to a 15% decline in testosterone, especially when combined with poor sleep habits. What's less known is how EMF, electromagnetic fields, from smartphones and laptops, when kept in close proximity to the body, can reduce sperm quality and testosterone over time. A 2014 study from Central European Journal of Urology revealed that men who kept their phones in their pockets for more than four hours a day had 30% lower sperm motility and significantly lower testosterone levels compared to those who didn't. To minimize the impact of technology, Try adopting a digital detox at night, turn off your devices an hour before bed and use blue light-blocking glasses if you must work on a screen in the evening. Keep your phone out of your pocket or use airplane mode when carrying it close to your body to reduce EMF exposure. Lastly, make time for tech-free activities that engage your body and mind, such as hiking, playing sports, or reading a book. 10. Neglecting regular health checkups American culture often values toughing it out, which is why many men put off regular doctor visits until something feels seriously wrong. However, testosterone issues don't always have noticeable symptoms until levels have dropped significantly. 
Skipping annual checkups means missing out on early detection of hormonal imbalances, which could be corrected with simple lifestyle changes if caught early enough. The American Urological Association recommends men over the age of 35 get their testosterone levels checked every two years to ensure early intervention if needed. Less commonly discussed is the impact of undiagnosed conditions like sleep apnea or prediabetes, both of which can silently lower testosterone without obvious signs. Research from the University of Chicago shows that men with untreated sleep apnea experience a 30% decrease in testosterone production, and pre-diabetic conditions affect testosterone levels by an average of 40%. Stay proactive about your health by getting routine blood work, including hormone panels that measure testosterone levels. You can even request at-home test kits to check your testosterone levels, which are increasingly available and convenient. While you're at it, ensure you're getting enough vitamin D, which is essential for testosterone production. A simple blood test can reveal deficiencies, and correcting it through supplements or sunshine can lead to a 20% increase in testosterone. In America, where convenience often comes at the expense of health, it's easy to fall into habits that quietly erode your testosterone levels. However, with a few key lifestyle changes, such as improving your diet, getting active, managing stress, prioritizing sleep, cutting back on alcohol, and quitting smoking, you can significantly improve your testosterone and overall well-being. Low testosterone doesn't have to be your future, and you have the power to make changes today. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe for more tips on optimizing your health, and stay tuned for more actionable advice to help you live your best life. Dr. Barbara O'Neill, co-founder of Misty Mountain Health Retreat, has helped thousands of people transform their lives through natural remedies. She firmly believes that flax seeds are a powerhouse for overall health. Three. Flax seeds have become a common breakfast staple, known for their rich omega content, which supports many bodily functions. However, when it comes to men's health, there's a hidden compound in flax seeds that every man must stop eating before it's too late. Are you curious to know what this compound is? In today's video on Fit Life Journey, I'll reveal the truth behind this health risk, backed by scientific research and insights from reputable official organizations. Stay tuned and let's uncover this crucial information together. Stop eating. 10 foods that increase estrogen extremely high that men must avoid. Do you know what foods might be sabotaging your hormonal health? It's a question that many men overlook, but the truth is that our diets play a crucial role in maintaining hormonal balance. Recent studies indicate that the average testosterone levels in men have declined by nearly 20% over the last three decades, according to research published in the Journal of Clinical Endocrinology. This drop is not merely a number, it can lead to serious health issues, including obesity, fatigue, mood swings, and even an increased risk of chronic diseases such as diabetes and heart disease. Balancing estrogen levels is crucial for men's health. Too much estrogen can lead to reduced libido, increased body fat, and decreased muscle mass. So, what food should we be cautious about? Stick with us until the end as we uncover some surprising insights and practical tips to safeguard your hormonal health. Moving on, let's dive into the first food that could be raising your estrogen levels. 1. Soy Products Soy products, including tofu, tempeh, and soy milk, have surged in popularity, especially in plant-based diets. However, what many may not realize is that soy contains phytoestrogens, compounds that can mimic estrogen in the body. According to a study published in the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition, men who consume high amounts of soy products, more than 25 grams of soy protein per day, may experience a notable increase in estrogen levels. In fact, another study from the Journal of Urology highlighted that men with high soy intake could see a 19% increase in estradiol, a potent form of estrogen, leading to potential hormonal imbalances. This is particularly concerning given that soy is found in various processed foods, making it easy to consume more than the recommended amounts. Instead of relying heavily on soy-based products, consider incorporating legumes like lentils and chickpeas into your meals. For instance, 
One cup of cooked lentils provides about 18 grams of protein and 16 grams of fiber, making it an excellent alternative that can help you meet your protein needs without the estrogenic effects of soy. Additionally, using nutritional yeast can add a cheesy flavor to dishes while being high in B vitamins and protein, offering around 8 grams of protein per 2 tablespoons without the phytoestrogens found in soy. To further reduce your soy intake, aim for a maximum of 25 grams of soy protein per day. This amount has been suggested as a threshold to prevent significant increases in estrogen levels. Also, if you do choose to consume soy, opt for fermented forms, such as miso or tempeh, which have shown a reduction in phytoestrogen content, about 40% less compared to unfermented soy products. But what about the next food that could be affecting your hormone balance? 2. Flax Seeds Flax seeds are often hailed as a superfood, rich in omega-3 fatty acids and fiber. Historically, these seeds have been used for their health benefits, but they also contain lignans, which are phytoestrogens. A study published in the Journal of Nutritional Biochemistry found that men who consumed more than 10 grams of flax seeds per day experienced a significant increase in serum estrogen levels, with an average rise of 15% in estradiol levels. Moreover, flaxseed oil has been shown to have a similar effect. A study from the European Journal of Clinical Nutrition reported that participants consuming flaxseed oil experienced a 30% increase in estrogen levels after just one month of consumption. Limit your flaxseed intake to about one tablespoon, approximately 10 grams, per day to prevent excessive lignin consumption. To easily incorporate flax seeds into your diet, consider adding them to smoothies or oatmeal, doing so can enhance your fiber intake, which is beneficial for gut health. For instance, one tablespoon of ground flaxseed contains about 2 grams of omega-3 fatty acids and 3 grams of dietary fiber. If you're looking for alternatives with less estrogenic activity, try using chia seeds. They offer about 5 grams of protein and 11 grams of fiber per ounce, and their high antioxidant content helps reduce inflammation without the estrogenic effects associated with flax seeds. Could something as common as dairy also be a problem? 3. Dairy Products Dairy has long been considered a staple in the American diet, often promoted for its calcium and protein content. However, many are unaware that dairy products can be loaded with hormones, including estrogen. The Food and Drug Administration FDA, has reported that milk from cows contains naturally occurring hormones that can affect hormonal health in men. Research published in the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition found that men who consumed three or more servings of dairy per day had a 20% higher level of estradiol compared to those who consumed less than one serving. A notable study conducted by the Harvard T.H. Chan School of Public Health also found that participants who consumed high-fat dairy products experienced a 22% increase in testosterone levels but also saw a rise in estrogen levels, which can lead to hormonal imbalances. To reduce hormone exposure, aim to limit your dairy intake to one serving per day. If you're consuming milk, consider choosing organic, Grass-fed options as these tend to have lower levels of synthetic hormones, studies indicate that organic milk can have up to 50% lower hormone levels than conventional milk. For a healthier alternative, try almond milk, which typically contains about 30 calories per cup compared to whole cow's milk at approximately 150 calories. Moreover, when looking for calcium sources, focus on dark leafy greens like kale and broccoli, which contain approximately 90 mg of calcium per cup and are free from hormonal additives. What about the next surprise in our list? 4. Processed Meats Processed meats have become a common convenience in modern diets, often found in fast food and ready-to-eat meals. Yet, these foods can contain additives and preservatives that affect hormone levels. The World Health Organization has classified processed meats as a carcinogen, linking their consumption to various health risks, including hormonal imbalances. A study published in the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition noted that men who consume higher quantities of processed meats, more than 50 grams per day, have increased levels of estradiol, with an average rise of 14% in their estrogen levels. Another study found that regular consumption of processed meats can lead to an increase in body fat, particularly visceral fat, 
which is associated with increased estrogen production. Men with higher body fat percentages are more likely to experience hormonal imbalances due to the aromatization process, where excess testosterone is converted into estrogen. Aim to keep your consumption of processed meats to no more than 50 grams per week, which equates to about two servings. To replace processed meats, consider lean protein sources such as skinless chicken breast or fish, which provide around 26 grams of protein per 3-ounce serving without harmful additives. Additionally, try incorporating plant-based proteins like quinoa, which offers 8 grams of protein per cooked cup and is a complete protein source. For a flavorful addition, explore marinated grilled vegetables as a side dish. They provide essential nutrients while being low in calories and free from harmful additives. What other foods should men be wary of? 5. Vegetable oils the shift from traditional fats to vegetable oils in cooking has become common in many households. However, these oils, particularly those high in omega-6 fatty acids, have been linked to hormonal imbalances. Research published in the Journal of Clinical Endocrinology suggests that a diet high in omega-6 fatty acids can disrupt hormonal balance and promote inflammation, which is associated with an increased risk of chronic diseases. A study conducted by the American Heart Association found that excessive intake of vegetable oils, more than 30 grams per day, is linked to an average increase of 15% in estrogen levels among men, contributing to hormonal dysregulation. Limit your intake of vegetable oils to less than 30 grams per day. Instead, focus on incorporating oils rich in monounsaturated fats, such as olive oil and avocado oil, which have been linked to improved heart health and hormonal balance. For example, one tablespoon of olive oil provides approximately 14 grams of healthy fats and can lower inflammation. Consider using alternatives like coconut oil, which has about 12 grams of saturated fat per tablespoon but also contains medium-chain triglycerides, MCTs, that may help with weight management and metabolism when cooking. Try using ghee, clarified butter, as it has a higher smoke point and can be a healthier option containing approximately 14 grams of fat per tablespoon, with a flavor profile that enhances many dishes. 6. High Sugar Foods History and Cultural Context – The Rise in Sugar Consumption in the U.S. Has been alarming, with average sugar intake soaring from about 15 grams per day in 1700 to over 150 grams per day for many adults today. This shift has been influenced by the proliferation of processed foods and sugary beverages in our diets, which often go unnoticed. Research published in the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition highlights that a high sugar diet can lead to hormonal imbalances, specifically increased insulin resistance, which may subsequently elevate estrogen levels. For instance, one study found that men consuming a diet high in sugar and refined carbohydrates showed a 23% increase in estrogen levels compared to those with a balanced diet. To cut down on sugar, aim for a maximum of 25 grams of added sugars per day. Instead of reaching for sugary snacks, opt for fruit as a sweet treat, for example, one medium apple contains about 19 grams of natural sugar and is packed with fiber, helping to regulate blood sugar levels. You can also try swapping out sugary drinks for flavored water or herbal teas, which can significantly reduce sugar intake. A study shows that individuals who replaced soda with water lost an average of 1.5 pounds per month. What about something you might have on your breakfast table? 7. Peanuts History and cultural context, peanuts have long been a popular snack in American cuisine, often touted as a healthy option due to their protein and fat content. However, they are commonly consumed in forms like peanut butter and mixed snacks, which can mask their negative effects. A study published in the Journal of Agricultural and Food Chemistry found that aflatoxins present in peanuts can mimic estrogen in the body, contributing to hormonal imbalances. Approximately 4% of peanuts may be contaminated with these toxins, which are known to have carcinogenic properties. To minimize the risk of aflatoxin exposure, limit peanut consumption to about 1 ounce, 28 grams, per week and choose organic peanuts whenever possible, as they tend to have lower contamination levels. 
Instead of peanuts, consider almonds, which provide approximately 6 grams of protein and 3.5 grams of fiber per ounce without the same estrogenic effects. You might also explore pumpkin seeds, offering 7 grams of protein and rich in zinc, essential for testosterone production. And what about those seemingly innocent snacks? 8. Hops in Beer History and Cultural Context Hops have been a crucial ingredient in beer making for centuries, contributing flavor and aroma. However, the cultural acceptance of beer consumption can overshadow its potential health impacts, especially regarding hormonal health. Research indicates that hops contain phytoestrogens, which can significantly influence hormonal balance. A study published in Phytochemistry Reviews found that consuming beer can raise estrogen levels in men by as much as 10%, potentially leading to negative health effects like gynecomastia, enlarged breast tissue. If you enjoy beer, consider limiting your consumption to one or two drinks per week and explore low-alcohol or alcohol-free alternatives that offer a similar taste profile without the estrogenic effects. For example, non-alcoholic beers are becoming increasingly popular, providing a refreshing option while containing lower levels of phytoestrogens around 0.5% alcohol by volume compared to traditional beers at 4-6%. Is there another drink that could be causing issues? 9. Licorice Root History and cultural context, licorice root has been used in traditional medicine for centuries, often praised for its sweet flavor and medicinal properties. However, many people overlook its potential hormonal effects. Studies, including one from phytotherapy research, reveal that consuming licorice can lower testosterone levels in men by as much as 30% within just two weeks of regular intake. This is primarily due to glycerizin, a compound found in licorice that can block the enzyme 11 beta hydroxysteroid dehydrogenase, leading to hormonal imbalances. Limit licorice consumption to no more than 2 grams per day to avoid adverse effects on hormone levels. For those who enjoy the taste, consider using anise or fennel seeds as a natural alternative, both of which provide a similar flavor profile without the hormonal impact. For instance, one teaspoon of fennel seeds has approximately 6 calories and contains compounds that support digestion without disrupting hormone balance. Finally, what is the last food men should avoid? 10. Certain fruits, like dried fruits. History and cultural context, dried fruits have become a popular snack option, often marketed as healthy due to their natural sugars and nutrients. However, the processing methods can lead to unintended health consequences. Research from the Journal of Food Science indicates that some dried fruits, particularly those with added sugars and preservatives, can contribute to increased estrogen levels. For example, commercially dried apricots often contain sulfites, which can spike estrogen when consumed in excess. To avoid hidden sugars, limit dried fruit intake to about a quarter cup per day. Instead, choose fresh fruits like berries, which are lower in sugar. One cup of strawberries contains about 7 grams of sugar and are high in antioxidants, which can help regulate hormonal levels. Moreover, incorporating a variety of fresh fruits ensures you get diverse nutrients without the additives found in many dried options. So, what are the consequences of ignoring these foods? Ignoring these dietary pitfalls can lead to significant long-term health consequences. High estrogen levels in men may contribute to various issues such as mood swings, weight gain, decreased energy levels, and even increased risk of certain health conditions like heart disease and reproductive health problems. If you found this information valuable, please like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more health tips and insights that can empower you to take control of your hormonal health.